A 99 year old veteran is taking a trip to back to where he fought for his country, Normandy, France during World War II. KDK's Alexandra Todd shows us his special send off today at the airport. I'm here at the Pittsburgh International Airport where we were about to send off Warren Goss heading back to France. I wouldn't have missed this for anything. Uh, Warren has meant a lot to us. Glenshaw native Warren Goss was 18 years old when he was drafted into the U.S. Army and sent to Europe in 1943. He volunteered to be a part of the 531st Special Brigade, who were some of the first brave soldiers to land on the Normandy beaches on D-Day. Now, 80 years later, at 99 years old, Goss is returning to where one of the most pivotal moments in history took place. I think it's, it's marvelous that he can go back, that he has the health and uh, is able to get around enough to go back and see what he has done for the world, not just our country, but for the world. He's going off to the 80th anniversary of the of D-Day, and I thought it would be good for people to be able to meet Warren, shake his hand, maybe thank him for his service, and maybe hear just a little bit of his story. He remembers his experiences vividly and reminds young people about the importance of history whenever he can. You can't explain that. All you do is wait and wait, and when the, when the ramp drops, then you go. But when that ramp dropped, you would have seen the first guys got hit. I went over the side. I didn't do that. I landed in water up in my neck. Goss and his nephew are staying with a French journalist and plan to take time to reflect. I want to go over there and see how those people appreciate their freedom. Todd DePostino, executive director of Veterans Breakfast Club, wanted to honor Goss and his return trip. I thought it would be good for the public to know that we still have World War II veterans around, witnesses to history, witnesses to one of the most important dates of the 20th century, and he's right among us. He's right here in Pittsburgh. We wish Warren and his nephew well on the big trip at the Pittsburgh International Airport. Alexandra Todd, KDK TV News.